Hi, I'm Allie Kerr, women's fitness expert, and today we're gonna do a four minute Tabata workout. So we're doing four exercises in four minutes. And we're gonna be focusing on the legs and the glutes. And we're also gonna be also, of course, focusing on our lungs. So we're gonna set the, I've got my interval timer set for eight intervals, and they're gonna be 20 seconds of work and 10 seconds of rest. We don't have long to rest in between, so it's really gonna get the heart pumping. I've got my clock set. The first exercise I'm gonna do is a step up. So I'm gonna have one foot on the bench, and here I go. I'm stepping up and down. You wanna go, try not to stay too long on the ground, just come right back up. So we're getting the heart pumping, and we're definitely working the legs. And we're doing this for 20 seconds. And then we're gonna change exercises. We're gonna do everything on the right leg first, and then we'll switch to the left side. All right, rest. Now we're going to our second exercise. I'm actually going to put my toe in the middle of the bench. I'm going to turn backwards. I'm going to have my hands up at my chest, and I'm going to be dropping down and pushing up. This is a Bulgarian split squat. I'm going to breathe out as I lift. And really squeeze the glutes each time you lift. Keep breathing. Really starting to feel it, that leg and the other leg and rest. Now I'm gonna walk around to the front. I'm gonna be using just the floor and my body weight. I'm gonna start with my feet about hip width and I'm gonna be doing a skater's lunge. I'm stepping back to the side. Making sure that my knee doesn't go out over my toe. Getting my hips back. Really working this hip. Breathing out at the top. Looking good, we're almost halfway done. I've only got one more exercise. Rest. We've got 10 seconds. Our last exercise is going to be a lateral lunge. So you can tell my heart rate's getting up. The lungs are working. Ready and go. So I'm keeping this leg straight, this leg bent. You can go to the ground if you can. Add a little bit of depth. And you're getting the heart rate up a little bit more. Almost there. rest, but not for too long, we're doing the other side. So we're going back around. This is my weaker leg. Most people have a weaker side, so my balance isn't as good either on that left leg. So you may have to kind of take your time, get your balance on that weaker leg, and then start pumping it out. Keep breathing. Most of us will start with our stronger leg, just a natural tendency but we gotta work the weaker one too. Same thing, sit in the middle. I'm gonna turn around, belly tall, hands up, and here we go. I'm gonna get a good stretch as you go down, squeeze as you come up. Stretch and strengthen. Keep breathing. We're almost there. All right, now we're gonna walk around the bench. We're gonna be doing everything on this side this time. We're gonna start with our hands at our chest, and we're crossing over out to the side. Kind of like a little curtsy, and then back out. Now, if you don't have a bench, you can still do this workout at home. If you have a staircase, all you need to do is step up and down on the stairs. Rest for that first exercise. If you have a staircase, you can also do the Bulgarian split squat. Ready? And this time we're going down. Opposite side, that's the first set. Touching the ground. So we're kicking it up. Keep breathing. Make sure you're not holding your breath. One thing that I've also used, if I didn't have a bench, was a cooler. Like a cooler you store, you put drinks in. A good high cooler, you can do step ups on that. So that'll allow you to do this workout at, at home, at the beach, or anywhere. So our timer's gone off, we've done four minutes. Legs and butt, and the lungs are really working. Great job.